We do. We're, we're, but the benefit is of a company like ours with great cash flow is we can do all of those things. We put more than $900 million last year into returns to our shareholders and dividends and share buybacks while still putting a billion dollars into our development of our beer business. You know, we're building out Veracruz. That will come out about a year, a little over a year from now. That will open. And we've added capacity of both Nava and Obregon. So we're continuing to invest in the future because we see a long runway for our brands. Okay, I know the analysts are going to be uh, disdainful if I don't say it. You do have a, you, you've you got the wine and spirit portfolio. It, it did not, was not up to snuff with you uh, last time I spoke. Now you've got someone new, fresh eyes, worth putting a lot of money toward or just kind of just let it go as is? Well, we spent a lot of time looking at it and saying, you know, what do we need to do? We're going to put a lot more focus on the critical brands, brands like The Prisoner and Miami and High West and Mi Campo as examples. Um, we're also going to make sure that we focus our attention on execution. Uh, I think we spread ourselves a little too thin the past year. Sam Glaser, who we just uh, introduced as the new president of the business, got over 30 years in the business. And we're really looking forward to what he can bring and the kind of executional excellence that we think will be important for that business going forward. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on X. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Mentions. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.